Somebody who studies sacred geometry, eventually you've got these numbers as such an integral part of your consciousness in your forehead, in your, in your frontal lobe, your waking consciousness that these numbers literally become a part of the way you experience reality and experience the world because the numbers are all around us in the world. It gives a shape to the world. It defines the periods of time that governs the cycles of our life. The number nine is a fascinating and significant number that appears in many different aspects of our lives, including astronomy, mythology, astrology, numerology, spirituality, cultural traditions, mathematics, and science. There were 144,000 casing stones on the Great Pyramid. Some religions believe that only 144,000 people are gonna make it to heaven or what they call the paradise. And so we see this recurring theme of this 144 being a very important number, even in the biblical text, 144,000, you know, angels are coming down with Jesus on his return. And so there's always this theme of this 144,000 over and over again throughout history, through many different civilizations and through many vastly different time periods. It makes you scratch your head like, what is up with this 144,000? Mm -hmm. It's got to be a significant number. Here's a Alethia which was the Greek word for truth. And if you add up the eta, the alpha, the lambda, the eta, theta, epsilon, iota, and alpha, based on the values that I just showed you, the total value is 72. And that's one of our key sacred numbers. Katabala, which means conception, the first moment of creation. Kappa, alpha, tau, alpha, beta, omicron, lambda, eta. Take the values again directly from the historically authenticated table that I showed you and they add up to 432. So there you see these numbers showing up here. Yerushalayim or Jerusalem. Iota, Epsilon, Rho, Omicron, Upsilon. This would be the Greek spelling in the New Testament. Sigma, Alpha, Lambda, Eta, and Mu. There's the values of the individual letters. Iota, which was 10, Epsilon, 5, etc. And when you add those up, you get 864. The Temple of Immortality. So if we take that spelling, add it up, it also is 864. The Holy Ghost, Toagian Numa. Add up the value of those and you get 1080. The Fountain of Wisdom, Pegasophias, also adds to 1080. Most of these numbers from 1440 to 8640, 43200, 144, 1728, 36, 1296 is that they all Kabbalistically add up and reduce to the single digit nine. Like Tesla said, if you can discover the mystery of 369, you know the mysteries of the universe. But yeah, the nine is a pretty significant number because it is an important number in a lot of mathematical computations, first and foremost. The final digit in numerology, the presence of nine suggests a chapter may be coming to an end. Witnessing nine as an angel number is a sign that a meaningful cycle could come to a close and you'll soon have a beginning of a brand new journey. If you take 25,920 seconds and set each second corresponding to one year, you'll discover it's exactly 432 minutes. 25,920 hours in turn is 1,080 days. And 25,920 days is equal to 72 years in the sacred calendar. The numbers come from one source, one multidimensional source and they stream down through the multidimensional universe down into this third dimension as a form of integrated consciousness. Here we have the alphabet of sacred geometry, and these are the simplest forms. These are the polygons. You have a, a circle, which is actually not a polygon, but we have an equilateral triangle, a square, and a pentagon. And each of these can be measured by the number of degrees that determine the angles of the sides. So for example, we look at a circle, which is just a special case of an ellipse with eccentricity of zero. We've covered this already, so let's go right to the equilateral triangle, and we'll see it's 60, 60, and 60, which equals 180 degrees. Again, notice that we've got the number nine recurring. We go to the square, which is four times 90 degrees. The total number of degrees defining the square is 360, the same as the circle, the same as the measure of a circle. And we measure the polygons by essentially measuring the angles of the vertices or the corners. Then likewise with the pentagon, each of the angles between successive edges is 108 degrees. So you multiply the 108 times five and you get 540. Again, notice everything adds up to nine. The periodic table has nine fundamental types of atoms known as lanthanides. 
The human body is made up of nine major organ systems, including the cardiovascular, nervous, and respiratory systems. The electromagnetic spectrum has nine main categories of waves, ranging from radio waves to gamma rays. The number nine is associated with completion and spiritual growth. It is the final single-digit number and represents the culmination of a cycle. The number nine is also linked to the planet Mars, which is associated with courage, energy, and passion. The ninth sign of the zodiac, Sagittarius, is known for its adventurous and expansive spirit, which reflects the qualities of the number nine. Additionally, the number nine is linked to the concept of karma, which refers to the idea that our actions have consequences that come back to us. That's because nine is the result of adding up all the single digit numbers before it. One plus two plus three plus four plus five plus six plus seven plus eight equals 36, and three plus six equals nine. In mythology, the number nine is often associated with spiritual growth and knowledge. For example, in Norse mythology, Odin hung from the world tree Yggdrasil for nine days and nine nights to gain wisdom and knowledge. In Greek mythology, nine muses inspired creativity and art, while in Egyptian mythology, nine gods presided over the underworld. In astrology, the number nine is associated with the planet Mars, which is said to govern ambition, energy, and action. People born under the sign of Mars, which is associated with the number nine, are said to be confident, independent, and adventurous. But what about the significance of the number nine in our everyday lives? While it may not always be obvious, the number nine plays a surprisingly important role in many aspects of our lives. For example, the human gestation period is approximately nine months, and the number nine is also significant in many cultural and religious traditions. In Chinese culture, for instance, the number nine is considered lucky and is often associated with weddings, birthdays, and other celebrations. In mathematics, the number nine has some unique properties as well. It's the highest single digit number, and any number multiplied by nine will always result in a number whose digits add up to nine. Additionally, the number nine is the sum of the first three square numbers. One square plus two square plus three square equals nine, and the sum of the first three cube numbers. One cubed plus two cubed plus three cubed equals 36. The number nine is a fascinating and important number that appears in many different areas of human knowledge. Its significance in our lives may not always be obvious, but it is present nonetheless. Whether we're celebrating a birthday or contemplating the mysteries of the universe, the number nine is sure to be a constant presence. In numerology, the number nine is associated with spiritual growth, wisdom, and completion. It is believed that individuals who have a life path number of nine are highly empathetic and compassionate with a strong desire to serve humanity. The number nine also holds special significance in various spiritual and religious traditions around the world. In Christianity, there are nine fruits of the Holy Spirit, including love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. In Hinduism, there are nine forms of the goddess Durga, each representing a different aspect of femininity and power. And in Buddhism, there are nine stages of the path to enlightenment. Furthermore, the number nine has also played an important role in various cultural and historical contexts. For instance, in the Mayan calendar system, nine levels of consciousness correspond to different stages of evolution. And in music, the ninth note of the scale is known as the subtonic, which is an important note for creating tension and leading to the tonic note. The number nine is unique for several reasons. Firstly, it is the highest single digit number, meaning that it's the last number before reaching double digits. This gives it a sense of completeness, as it's the final number in the sequence of single digits. Secondly, in mathematics, nine has unique properties when multiplied by any other number. For example, when multiplying any number by nine, the digits of the product will add up to nine. For instance, nine times two is 18, and one plus eight equals nine. This unique property is known as the digital root, or reduced digital sum, and is related to modular arithmetic. Thirdly, nine is the only number that, when multiplied by any other number, results in a repeating pattern of digits. For instance, when multiplying nine by three, the result is 27, and when adding the digits of 27 together is nine. This pattern continues with all nine multiples of nine, making it a unique and fascinating number. Finally, the number nine has cultural and spiritual significance in many traditions, 
such as Hinduism, Buddhism, and Christianity. In Hinduism, there are nine planets or grahas, and the Navagraha is worshipped for good fortune and blessings. In Buddhism, there are nine levels of consciousness, and in Christianity, there are nine fruits of the Holy Spirit. Overall, the number nine is unique due to its mathematical properties, cultural and spiritual significance, and symbolic meanings. Its distinct properties and associations make it a fascinating number to explore and contemplate. In astronomy, the number nine has significance in the relationship between the sun, moon, and earth. It is said that the sun completes a cycle of 360 degrees in the sky in one year, which is divided into 12 zodiac signs, with each sign taking up 30 degrees. The moon, on the other hand, talks about 29 and a half days to complete its cycle around the earth, and during this time, it passes through all 12 zodiac signs. Interestingly, the total number of days in the solar year, 365.24, multiplied by the number of lunar months in a year, 12.37, equals 4,536.24, which can be reduced to 9. This is known as the lunar solar cycle, and it is believed to be a powerful symbol of completion and transformation. Moreover, in Vedic astrology, the nine planets or grahas are believed to have significant influence on human destiny and are associated with different qualities and energies. These planets include the Sun, Moon, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Rahu, and Ketu. The Sun and Moon are considered the most important planets, as they are responsible for life on Earth and are associated with the soul and mind, respectively. While every number has its unique properties and significance, there are a few that are considered to be similarly unique as the number 9. One such number is the number 8. Like 9, 8 is a single-digit number with special properties. In mathematics, 8 is a perfect cube, meaning that it is the cube of a whole number, in this case, 2. It is also the only positive integer that is the sum of the digits of its cube. For example, 2 cubed is 8, and the sum of the digits of 8 cubed is also 8. Additionally, 8 is considered to be a lucky number in many cultures, including Chinese, Japanese, and Korean. It's associated with prosperity, wealth, and success. In some cultures, 8 is also believed to have mystical properties, such as the ability to ward off evil spirits. Another number that is considered to be unique is the number 1. In mathematics, 1 is the multiplicative identity, meaning that any number multiplied by 1 is equal to itself. It is also the additive identity, meaning that any number added to 0 is equal to itself. In spiritual and philosophical traditions, one is often associated with unity, wholeness, and the universe. In Hinduism, for example, the concept of Brahman refers to the oneness of all things, while in Taoism, the Tao is often represented by a single circle or point, symbolizing the unity of all things. Overall, while the number 9 has its unique properties and significance, other numbers are similarly fascinating and rich in meaning. Number 9 also plays a significant role in various scientific and mathematical contexts. In physics, the number 9 appears in the fundamental equations that describe the behavior of the universe, such as the nine-dimensional equations of string theory. In mathematics, the number 9 is used in a variety of numerical systems, including the base 9 system used by the ancient Maya. Interestingly, the number 9 also has a unique relationship with the number 3. When multiplied by any single digit number, the digits of the resulting product always add up to 9. The number 9 also holds significance in popular culture. For example, The Beatles' Revolution 9 is a groundbreaking experimental track that features various sound effects and spoken word samples. And in the film The Nine Lives of Fritz the Cat, the title character experiences nine different lives as he navigates various adventures and misadventures. Number 9 is a fascinating and multifaceted number that has played a significant role in human knowledge and culture throughout history. Its properties and meanings are complex and varied, and it continues to be a subject of study and exploration in many fields. Whether we are contemplating the mysteries of the universe, exploring our spirituality, or simply enjoying a piece of music or film, the number 9 is sure to be a constant presence in our lives. The significance of the number 9 in music is rooted in its harmonic properties. The ninth note of the scale, 
known as a subtonic, is a crucial note for creating tension and leading to the tonic note. This creates a sense of resolution and closure in musical phrases. Additionally, the number 9 appears in musical time signatures such as 9-8 which adds a unique and complex rhythmic texture to the music. The number 9 also plays a symbolic role in music as in the Beatles' Revolution 9, a groundbreaking experimental track that features various sound effects and spoken word samples. Overall, the number 9 adds depth and complexity to the music, both in its harmonic properties and its symbolic significance. Other numbers share some properties with the number 9. For example, the number 3 also has spiritual and mystical associations in many cultures, and it's considered a sacred number in many religions. Like 9, the number 3 also appears in many significant cultural and religious concepts, such as the Holy Trinity in Christianity, the Three Jewels in Buddhism, and the Triple Goddess in Wicca. Additionally, the number 6 is also associated with balance and harmony, and it appears in many significant concepts, such as the hexagon, which is a shape that appears frequently in nature and is associated with stability and structure. The number 6 is also considered to be a symbol of love as it represents the union of two triangles, a downward triangle representing the feminine and an upward triangle representing the masculine, which form the Star of David, a symbol of unity and harmony. Overall, while the number 9 has its unique properties and associations, other numbers share some similarities and hold their significance in various cultural and spiritual contexts. The impact of the number 9 on our lives can be seen in various ways, both in spiritual and practical contexts. 1. Spiritual Significance In many spiritual and mystical traditions, the number 9 is considered a symbol of spiritual enlightenment and completion. It's often associated with higher consciousness, selflessness, and compassion. Meditating or focusing on the number 9 can help individuals connect with their higher selves and achieve a sense of inner peace and balance. Number 2. Numerology in numerology, which is the study of the spiritual and mystical significance of numbers, the number 9 is associated with creativity, humanitarianism, and philanthropy. People born under the number 9 are said to be artistic, compassionate, and focused on helping others. Number 3. Practical Applications The number 9 also has practical applications in our daily lives. For example, there are 9 digits in the standard Western numerical system, making it a foundational number in mathematics and computation. Additionally, the number 9 appears in many areas of science, such as the periodic table, where there are 9 elements in the group known as the noble gases. Number 4. Cultural Significance Finally, the number 9 holds significant cultural and historical meaning in many traditions around the world. For example, the 9 worthies were a group of historical and legendary figures from different cultures who were seen as exemplars of chivalry and virtue. In Chinese culture, the number 9 is associated with longevity and good fortune and is often seen as a lucky number. Number 9 has a significant impact on our lives, both in spiritual and practical contexts, and can provide guidance and inspiration for those seeking greater meaning and understanding in the world around them. The significance of the number 9 in history and literature can be seen in a variety of contexts and cultural traditions in terms of its numerical value and its symbolic meaning. Here are a few examples. Number 1. Nine Muses In Greek mythology, the Nine Muses were the goddesses of inspiration in the arts and sciences such as music, poetry, and astronomy. They were said to be the daughters of Zeus and Nemesine and were believed to provide inspiration and guidance to human beings. Number 2. Nine Worthies The Nine Worthies were a group of historical and legendary figures from different cultures who were seen as exemplars of chivalry and virtue. They were divided into three categories of three, pagan, Jewish, and Christian. The pagan worthies were Hector, Alexander the Great, and Julius Caesar. The Jewish worthies were Joshua, David, and Judas Maccabeus. And the Christian worthies were King Arthur, Charlemagne, and Godfrey of Bouillon. Number 3. Ennead In ancient Egyptian mythology, the Ennead was a group of nine gods and goddesses who were worshipped in the city of Heliopolis. The Ennead included the god Atum, who was believed to have created the world, and his children, Shu and Tefnut, who represented air and moisture, respectively. Number 4. Nine Emperor Gods Festival The Nine Emperor Gods Festival is a Taoist festival celebrated in Southeast Asia, particularly in Thailand, Malaysia, and Singapore. The festival is held in the ninth lunar month and is dedicated to the worship of the Nine Emperor Gods, who are believed to bring good luck and prosperity. Number 5. Dante's Divine Comedy 
In Dante's Divine Comedy, which is widely considered one of the greatest works of literature in Western history, the poem is divided into three parts of 33 cantos each, for a total of 99 cantos. The final section of the poem, Paradiso, consists of 33 cantos, which are divided into three groups of nine. Number 6. Shakespeare's Sonnets Shakespeare's sonnets are a collection of 154 poems, and the number 9 plays a significant role in their structure. The poems are divided into three groups of 54, 28, and 27 sonnets respectively. The final group of 27 sonnets is further divided into three groups of nine. Number 7. The Nine Tailors The Nine Tailors is a detective novel by Dorothy L. Sayers, first published in 1934. The title refers to the nine tailors of a church bell, and the novel includes numerous references to the number nine, such as the nine strokes of a clock and the nine men who make up a team of bell ringers. Number 8. Nine Stories Nine Stories is a collection of short stories by J.D. Salinger, first published in 1953. The collection includes nine stories, and the number nine appears throughout the book, such as in the ninth story, Teddy, which is about a child prodigy who is nine years old. Number nine has played a significant role in the structure and symbolism of many works of literature, used by authors to convey themes of completion, structure, and balance, and various cultural and historical traditions, and has been associated with concepts such as inspiration, virtue, and spirituality. The ninth letter of the alphabet is I, which is also the Roman numeral for the number one. This means that IX is nine in Roman numerals which is why you sometimes see clocks or watches with IX instead of IX to represent 9. Moreover, in Indian astronomy, the Earth is considered a planet, is believed to be the center of the universe. The Earth is also associated with the number 9, as it takes approximately 365.25 days to complete one orbit around the Sun, which is divisible by 9. 365.25 divided by 9 equals 40.5833. This is known as the side real year and it's the basis of the Hindu calendar, which is based on lunar months. Furthermore, the ancient Indian texts, including the Vedas and the Upanishads, describe the relationship between the sun, moon, and earth in great detail. They explain how the position of the sun and the moon influences the tides, weather patterns, and human behavior. The sun and the moon are also believed to represent the masculine and feminine aspects of creation, respectively and their union is seen as a symbol of balance and harmony. In Indian numerology, the number 9 is associated with selflessness, humanitarianism, and spiritual awareness. It is considered to be a powerful number that has transformative properties and is believed to bring good fortune and prosperity. The number 9 is also associated with completion and fulfillment, as it is the last single-digit number and represents the end of a cycle. In conclusion, the number 9 has a deep connection with the Sun, Moon, and Earth in Indian astronomy and astrology. It is associated with vitality, emotions, and spiritual awareness, and is believed to bring good fortune and prosperity. The number 9 serves as a reminder of the importance of balance and harmony in our lives, and the interconnectedness of all things in the universe. Thank you for watching. If this video resonated with you or added value, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Until next time. Keep listening, keep growing, and keep shining. Stay blessed.